Hey family, what's going on? Klaus here and thank you for tuning in. Today we're going to be back on my Tunnel 9 account and we are farming this baby to max as we've only got level 12 king and queen and we've got level 1 expos. But guys, we're working on offense first, of course, and the uh, worst thing ever is my laboratory is not doing anything right now. So let's go use my favorite Tunnel 9 farming strategy, the Lunian. Actually, technically, I've got my Lava Hound of the Clan Castle, so it's, it's a La Lunian, technically. Um, but I've got two Rages, four Hates, and a Poison in my spells. I've also got got 34 balloons and 25 minions and of course my heroes clan castle lava hound or balloons max balloons works really well too and a clan castle haste so let's go out let's find some loot so i've been i've been finding some monster loot guys up here in the master league one it's been amazing guys let's go find some loot and take it out together it's it's gorgeous up here guys Oh man, okay, so 3,700 Dark Elixir and over 500,000 Elixir, this is a beautiful base, plus the gold is good too, it's like an uncollected base, it's not a dead base, but check it out guys, these Expos are on ground, which is absolutely, actually wait, wait, is this on air or ground, I think that one might be on air, but that one's definitely on ground, so that's really cool, also we've got an exterior queen, so let's go ahead, actually I'm going to keep my poison spell, I'm going to suicide my king on the enemy queen, because um, the queen can single-handedly ruin a Lunian raid, guys. Absolutely single-handedly ruin it. So, next step, guys, that we got rid of the queen is let's look at these sweepers. We got one that's pointing up into the base, so we can come behind that. Or we can come behind this one. So, where's the Dark Elixir? We got one here, and we've got one here. Okay, so I'm just going to come at this base from this bottom side. And the best deployment I, uh, that I can uh, kind of, like the best advice I can give you guys is come from one side, but make sure to encompass the... Uh, the corners a little bit so i'm gonna do uh, three fingers on each side just actually wait 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 let's take out this bomb tower it's gonna distract our stuff there we go okay do we have any other exterior defenses no okay so let's get this thing going guys three two one bam throw it down that's right clan castle down the middle we got a hound also let's throw down our balloons let's haste the edges first and also haste the core so we're doing good there Let's uh, drop a rage on either side. Now we've got two hastes on either side too to help out with any uh, kind of any groups that aren't doing what we want them to do. So there we go, just like that. And then also let's put another haste just like that. So I think, I think guys that we might get it. Let me put down my queen over here. We'll work on these archer towers and um, hopefully our uh, our balloons can take out both the archer towers and the uh, the Tesla. So both are down. We got one more archer tower down. Pop the queen's ability. And I think we have got the three star guys. The loot in this base was gorgeous. And oh, there's one more. There's one more. If only that haste was cheated over just a little bit further. Look at all those air bombs, guys. That was insane. But look at this. Bam. Just like that. Now the balloons will start targeting loot. We got a bunch of minions. We got a queen. That was gorgeous, guys. So what did this base in was the fact that the queen was on the outside. If that it had all four of the air defenses, so that wasn't a thing. But the main issue, oh, a giant bomb killed my queen. That was messed up. Really? That wasn't fair. That wasn't fair. Whatever. So we, we ended up getting all the loot, guys. And that's what that's really what is the most important thing over a half a million elixir over 3700 dark elixir plus a full loot bonus and 16 cups which i don't really care about anyway but hey that'll work so with the loot bonus we guys we got 500,000 gold holy cow uh we had 700,000 elixir that's quick math right there and then 4600 dark elixir Booyah! That's a gorgeous, that's just beautiful, guys. That's wonderful. So, while I wait, I'm going to go ahead and request for Clan Castle Troops. My heroes will not be alive for the next attack, but that's all okay. Let's look at this uh, last replay here against Nurse Angel. All right, Nurse Angel. Like it, love it. Look at the loot grab, guys. I got 5,800 Dark Elixir plus a loot bonus, a full loot bonus, but this is a dead Tunnel 10. We got some dead Infernos all burnt out. We got some dead Expos all empty but we got a level 30 archer queen and she is mad so we have to uh, we have to struggle through that but this base had over six thousand dark elixir and beautiful stuff guys unfortunately we failed ah click the wrong button unfortunately we failed to um to grab all the dark elixir i think it's because of the town hall mainly but let's look at this base so before we start let's look at what we've got going on we got a central queen which means that we can't take her out at the beginning of the raid which is unfortunate but it is what it is. So we're going to look at these sweepers, all right? The sweepers. We got one pointing up toward the uh, top right, 
And we also got one pointing down to the top, to the bottom left. And so which side should we come from? Well, I chose this side because two of the three drills are on this side. We got one on the far side and then the, the uh, Dark Elixir storage in the middle. So I, I went for the Dark Elixir knowing that this is a Tunnel 10 base. I wasn't going to be able to three star, at least that was my thought. So why not get as much of the drills as possible? And maybe we'll steal this one if we don't make it all the way with our heroes. So I've got my uh, Clown Castle Hound coming down. We got our balloon being laid out straight in a line minions behind watch this guys we'll have a hay spell down on the bottom corner a hay spell on the top corner just like so hay spell in the middle get everything in quickly and then we'll haste a line up to that air defense over there and haste a line over there but it was wasted unfortunately we get a rage in the core and then we'll end up placing another rage over here just to try to clear up all these defenses having to do with uh surrounding the dark elixir storage now, unfortunately for us this queen did survive and ends up ruining all the balloons life right there uh, but we do have a pretty good amount of balloons that are still alive over here. So it def it definitely helps uh, clean out all the defenses around the uh, Dark Elixir storage. Good thing our minions came in the clutch and took out the enemy queen. Unfortunately, though, they are too close. And watch this. Balloons are going to die. And then the air defense starts sniping minions. So we did not quite get that town hall. Uh, but the good thing is, look at all these balloons, guys. They're going to come. They're going to clear up some important defenses. For instance, let's see. That wizard tower drop. Oh, Oh my goodness, this arch tower didn't drop. I thought it did. That's terrible. And this air defense. If that air defense would have uh, would have went down, we would have survived taking out the town hall and the dark leash storage. But fortunately for us, we have we're gonna get a lucky split. Okay, we got some minions over here, um, and I'll go ahead and double time because this is kind of a timing issue. Um, the minions gonna come down, work in the builders' hall, the middle hut, and then they're gonna take out the laboratory. Now they're working on the dark elixir storage. So we got a lucky split. They're gonna get the dark elixir out of the storage. They are gonna get shot down before they get the town hall, I believe. Yeah, yeah, that's not gonna happen. And there we go. So the choice was look at all look at that health, guys. Not much health. So the choice, guys, was let's get the dark elixir out of the drill. There's more in the drill than there is in the town hall. So I dropped my king for tanking. We're also gonna get all this elixir and gold on the outside, and then the dark elixir in the drill behind the wall will get grabbed by the queen. So everything is good, guys. All is well as we lock on to a ton of loot. And again, guys, if that air defense, which barely has, look at that loot. I mean, look at that health. Barely any health, guys. If it would have went down just a little bit more luck, we would have gotten the town hall, gotten the two-star, and over 400 more dark elixir. But things didn't work out quite that way. So I'm going to go ahead and speed up the time. She works on the wall. I'm just going to, yeah, I just get percentage at this point. But I do want to wait until we get the overall sum. So pop her ability, get some more percentage, and then lock out. Now, after 70%, percentage doesn't matter. But... <laughs> Bragging rights, right? So 87% one star on a dead channel 10 over half a million gold, nearly half a million elixir. And with the loot bonus, we got over 6,500 dark elixir in that raid. Gorgeous stuff, guys. All with Lunium up here in the Master League. Now, I do not have a clan castle. I'm going to wait until I get my clan castle or until my heroes wake up. One or the other or both and then we'll go out and do a another raid, a final raid before we get this laboratory going and try to get all five of our builders going. <laughs> All right, guys, I've been searching for a little while. 2,500 Dark Elixir is not too bad, plus our loot bonus is over that 3,000 mark, which is my minimum. So I'm going to hit this base. Plus, one of the things that I noticed was that it's got two air defenses upgrading, which is amazing. And we've got a pretty outside queen. So let's, uh, oh, I don't have my heroes. Oh my goodness. Okay, okay. So here's what we're going to do. I just realized that I, for I didn't forget, but I, I, I didn't get my heroes. But I do have a clan castle of max balloons. So we're going to hit this base as if we were going to just, just blow through the base. We're going to wipe out the base. And we're going to come from the queen side. Because if we were to put down a rage spell over where the queen was, the raged minion should, in theory, take out the queen. So, let's come from the top right because that's in the sweeper blind. And kind of cheat it slightly to the south. So, I'm going to do like a four finger deployment here. Right there. Just like so. Come on. Let's go. All right. Then minions just like that. Let's put a, uh, let's put that down. Let's also rage. Oh, and we got some clan castle troops. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, no. This is bad, guys. This is really bad. This is not good at all. Um, we might have just got trolled by a bunch of minions, guys. I did not do a clan castle lure, and it might have just ruined everything. I'm, I'm not entirely sure just yet. Um, I Luckily, we had some minions that came in the clutch. So what about... What about those minions, guys? Yes, we were saved. That is awesome. All right, let's uh, let's drop our let's drop our our hay spell down. Hopefully, we can get rid of some of these um, air targeting defenses. There we go. Go straight for that Tesla. That's what's up. 
all right so it looks like we might miss out on these defenses up here all of our air targeting defenses are down on everywhere else in the base we are going to get the dark i cannot believe that those minions came in the clutch like that that was absolutely amazing and if we can get the minions to distract that wizard tower come on baby yes all right keep 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 that wizard tower distracted oh no come on come on come on come on come on come on oh <laughs> yes we got we got the wizard tower but i think that arch tower will still defend we don't have a lot of minions and they're not going straight up the arch tower so we might miss out on the three star but it's okay i mean we got all the dark elixir that's what we came for right i mean these minions are being awesome they're getting all that elixir we need elixir obviously we need everything um and now these stupid minions are going to get stuck on the king guys come on i mean really the king's not going to hurt you he's not going to hurt you what are you doing uh okay well that's okay now let's let these minions finish up and we'll get all the loot out of these mines and uh, then we'll cut out because there's nothing else of value anywhere near them so take out these mines buddies and then that'll be it guys so we actually did pretty well considering clan castle wizards are like the worst thing against lunium especially because i didn't have any kind of uh any kind of cc lure or anything like that that was kind of stupid on my part but at the end of the day it still worked out great if we had maybe our heroes we would have easily got the three star either way again guys poison the enemy queen or this or the clan castle that works too but if you rage over those, the rage minions can take off the enemy heroes and the enemy CC really, really easily. So, with all that being said, guys, actually, these minions are about to get shot down. Watch this. Oh, wow. Nice. All right, well, I'm not going to stop it, man. Every shot's taking out like six, 700 gold. So, yeah, keep going, man. Keep going. Every shot is, a next, is another next is, is for the next in cost. So, yeah, buddy, keep it up, man. You're awesome. Five, four, three, two, one yeah nice guys nice 85 percent two star locked on a decent amount of loot gold was okay plus a loot bonus so 300 000 gold is the minimum so very nice plus 470 000 elixir and 3400 dark elixir so not too shabby considering we had we almost had a, a major meltdown with that enemy clan castle those wizards man they they command man they shoot fireballs out of everywhere i mean look at look at this guy look at this guy yeah fireball just like that i mean that's what they do so i'm really really glad that we got all the dark elixir that was exactly what we needed and i'm very pleased with my raged minions <laughs> so let's cut out of there guys let's go to my progress base and get some upgrades done it is time to get this laboratory rolling guys this laboratory has been sitting by itself on like b basically wasting time for a while now so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna upgrade this golem okay because the golem was made one of the major reasons why i failed a title nine dojo recently so so we definitely need stronger golems for the tanking purposes and um it's only seventy thousand dark elixir so i've got at least 80 88,000 maybe so let's go ahead and do this guys in three two one bam there we go guys that is awesome all right so the golems upgrade we get eight days for that now let's do some other upgrades um i definitely want to spend my elixir first and the only elixir upgrades we have left on the base are storages dark elixir storage and the dark elixir uh drill so let's go ahead and get this storage going guys because i did foresee an issue with uh max storage so let's go ahead and do this 3.6 million elixir at three two one bam there we go and that will be max so we can go ahead and move this guy uh let's go ahead and put that right there and then also we got three million elixir which is perfect for doing one of these drills so let's go ahead and do this as well and what that's going to do guys that's going to take him to level four and level six is the max so that's awesome we've also spent all of our elixir i do think i've got something in the oh wow eight hundred thousand. okay let's do let's do a gold upgrade next guys let's go ahead and do a tesla okay the teslas are a very very valuable upgrade they don't have a very high war weight and their dps single targeting dps for ground and air absolutely incredible so the only problem is that their range is pretty small they get a pretty small range but i love that they can surprise people so having good strong teslas is a very good thing to do so seven to upgrade 2.5 million gold three two one bam nice all right so oh no no that's not maxed <laughs> we only move up buildings that are maxed by the way so that's done there we got two builders left i don't have enough dark elixir for a hero so we literally can spend all this gold on different upgrades uh what's the cheapest upgrade a wizard tower um 700 000. we do have some bombs to upgrade we've also got a hidden tesla we could max this tesla you know what let's go ahead and do that let's upgrade a tesla it's going to go to town hall 9 level max which is level 7 i believe yeah i'm pretty sure so let's go ahead and do this guys 10 day upgrade 3.5 million gold three two one bam nice all right so let's go get go ahead and get this guy up here put him there Th this is this is where buildings go this is like building heaven guys once they get done for town hall nine or whatever town hall i'm on i move them across the build the wall and then i don't have to think about them anymore it's awesome now let's collect the treasury because 
I uh, I got like pretty decent amount of loot in there. And then before we uh, before we close out and uh, do our last upgrade, I need to determine what I'm gonna upgrade and if I have any loot left over. So um, a bomb is 1.5 million. So it would be kind of cool to get the bombs done. Also, the seeking air mines would be great. Actually, you know what? Let's do the seeking air mines because they're awesome against defending uh, like air air attacks, and that's the most like that's the most common right now. So let's go ahead and do a mine right now, and I believe level two is max. So I'll go ahead and do this one. Two million gold, one day upgrade in three, two, one, bam. Nice, guys, nice. And we don't have any gold left over, so we did that just right. I'm going to leave that there just to confirm that's max. Let me know in the comments if it is. I'm, I'm pretty sure. But I, just, I don't want to move something up and not be max and then forget about it. You know what I mean? So I'd rather be safe than sorry. But guys, all that loot was spent. We got the golems going in the laboratory. Tons of important upgrades. Low war weight upgrades as well as some dark elixir infrastructure like a drill and storage. Excellent stuff. Very pleased with what's going on, guys. And I will definitely be farming. I'm going to try out a queen walk next video in our Tunnel 9 Let's Play. So be sure to check out that. Also, guys like this video if you liked it if you learned something enjoyed some uh almost three stars actually we did get a three star with just lunion so really awesome subscribe if you're not joined the class family guys and um, also don't forget to follow me on twitter i'm doing giveaways in celebration of over 50,000 subscribers we'll be doing that for the next couple of weeks my twitter handle is up above the link is down below in the video description so that is all for me guys i love each and every one of you and as always i'll see y'all again next time Thank <laughs> you.